In 1979 Dassault was contracted to produce two prototypes of the Mirage 2000P penetration that were intended to replace the aging Mirage IVP in the nuclear strike role. Later designated 2000N Nuclear, this version of the 2000B trainer features a strengthened airframe to cope with high subsonic, low-level flight and an Antelope 5 terrain following radar that provides automatic terrain following down to 91M at speeds up to 112 km per hour. The primary armament is the 850 kg Aerospatial ASMP Standoff Tactical Strike Missile. This has a dual yield of 150 or 300 kt and a range of over 80 km from low altitude launch. The 2000N achieved initial operating capability in July 1988 and was built in two versions, NK-1 Dedicated Nuclear Strike, 31 built, and NK-2 with additional conventional attack capability, 46 built. It superseded the Mirage IVP which was the mainstay of French nuclear deterrence till the end of Cold War. Delays with the Rafale program generated a requirement for more aircraft solely for conventional attack. The resulting 2000N and Prime flew in prototype form in 1990. The designation was later changed to 2000D, diversified, and 75 examples were built for delivery from 1993. These differ from the 2000N by having an upgraded countermeasure suite and cockpit systems with more integrated hands on stick and throttle controls. The key to much of the 2000D's precision attack capability is the PDCLT laser designator slash TV slash thermal imaging pod carried beneath the starboard air intake. It allows the 2000D to direct weapons such as the AS-30L laser-guided missile or BGL-1000 laser-guided bombs. In 2001 the Army DLR fielded three squadrons each of 2000DS, all based at Nancy and 2000NS, two units at Luxul and one at Istras. In 1997 Abu Dhabi ordered 30 new build Mirage 2000 to 9 long-range attack aircraft. Later designated 2000 to 5 MK2, these will be joined by all 33 remaining examples of Abu Dhabi's earlier batch, including 2000 DDA trainers, upgraded to 2000 to 9 standard.